Happy 4th of July, Nintendo Week viewers! It's a great day for America and an awesome day for video games. Today, I'll play boss challenge mode in the game The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time 3D and show you the Pokedex 3D application for Nintendo 3DS. And I'll show you two things from the Nintendo eShop. The downloadable game Super Mario Land and the feature that lets you rate titles you've played. Plus, in honor of summer, we'll check out some of our favorite beach levels from Nintendo games. Hey bros! Dark Gary! I'm getting my 4th of July fireworks ready. Check it out. 100% made in America. In my roof tent. <laughs> Cowards! We've been having a great time playing the game The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time 3D. It's been so much fun to experience the adventure all over again and we're loving the new features. One of our favorites is Boss Challenge Mode. Once you reach a certain point in the game, you can have Link go to sleep in his bed and he'll dream about the boss fights he's already experienced, allowing you to play them again. The battles are the same except for one thing. Now they're timed so you can keep trying to beat your own score. Let's take a look. We'll start with Queen Goma. Here we go. Look at that eye. All right, Link, let's do it. Use the slingshot. Nice, now she's stunned and I can go in with my sword and do some damage. Every time she takes damage, she climbs up to the ceiling and drops these eggs. Gotta take them out before they hatch into goma larvae. Ooh. Infernal dinosaur, King Dodongo. He's a big one and he spits fire. Let's run over here, pick up a bomb flower, and try to throw it right into, oh! There went my shield and we're on fire. No biggie, no sweat. You can avoid his roll attack by hugging the wall or standing near the lava. So you have a limited time with the bomb flower before it explodes. There we go. Nice, when he turns blue, you can go in with your sword. Baronade. This is a tough one, has a lot of components. So what's the battle plan? Ouch, not to get electrocuted, I'll tell you that, that hurt. First order of business is to get him down from the ceiling. If you throw the boomerang at the tentacles, you can cut them off one at a time. Let's get some recovery hearts. So I'll just use my boomerang. Oh, I avoid the berries. Okay, so now once I stun Baronade, I can go after the berries individually. Two, three, four. Five. Yeah. Once you've taken care of the berries, you can go after Baronade himself. All right, let's go for the body. After you complete boss challenge mode, you'll be able to fight all the bosses back to back. Try it for yourself. Pick up a copy of The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time 3D today. Super Mario Land was originally released as the launch title for the Game Boy system. Now, thanks to the Virtual Console section of the Nintendo eShop, you can play this classic title right on your Nintendo 3DS system. Super Mario Land is the first game to feature Daisy, Princess of Sarasaland. She's been kidnapped by the mysterious spaceman Tatanga, and it's up to Mario to save her. There are classic elements of the Super Mario games here, from question blocks and Goombas to Mario's enemy stomping skills. But the game also has some features that don't appear anywhere else in the series. For example, bombshell Koopas. When you jump on them, this happens. There are tons of other unique enemies too, like speedy Toko Tokos and unstoppable Peompies. And Mario uses armed and dangerous vehicles, like the Marine Pop underwater and the Sky Pop in the sky. <laughs> this makes some levels more like side-scrolling shooters. 
Right now, I'm gonna try out the second level in Muda Lands. Huh. This game totally takes me back. Uh, this guy's head flies off if you don't stomp him. Some familiar platforming here. Even the coin rooms are tricked out in this game. To get all the coins, I need to go into the top chamber first. Use a fireball to collect some of those coins. And then backtrack out here. Hit this block to get the coins on the bottom. And the timing's a little tricky here. These always make my heart skip a beat when I jump. Okay, what I do next may shock you. First, I'm gonna let this bombshell Koopa explode near me, taking damage and becoming regular Mario. Now, I jump here and check this out. <laughs> Invisible platform. Collect all these coins, watch out for the Goombas. And there's a mushroom here, I think, yep. And you really have to watch your timing to avoid those fireballs. Got him. Each level ends with a tower that has two entrances. If you go in the lower door, you just move to the next level. But if you can get to the top door, you get a bonus game. That's what makes this game so challenging. There are literally fewer pixels to land on. One up, I'll take it. And check this out. Because Super Mario Land is an old school game, normally you'd have to start from the very beginning if you got a game over. But with the virtual console version, you can create a restore point to begin from any time. Super Mario Land is a must for players of the Super Mario series. Download it today only from the Nintendo eShop. The game's Pokemon Black version and Pokemon White version introduced more than 150 all-new Pokemon to fans around the world. And with the arrival of the Nintendo eShop, players can now enjoy all these Pokemon in full 3D. The Pokedex 3D is a free application that lets you collect data on more than 150 Pokemon from the Pokemon Black version and Pokemon White version video games. You can rotate each Pokemon a full 360 degrees, zoom in and out, and view it from any angle. You can even hear each Pokemon's distinct cry and watch it in motion as it performs a move. The Pokedex 3D also allows you to search, sort, and filter your Pokemon data in a variety of ways. When you download the Pokedex 3D, you'll start out with 16 Pokemon, and there are a couple of ways to get more. If you activate Spot Pass, you'll receive the data for new Pokemon each day. Or friends can lend each other a helping hand by sharing Pokemon data locally. Just click on Give or Get. The Pokedex 3D application is only available from the Nintendo eShop. Download it for free and start building your Pokedex today. There are a ton of great beach-themed levels and stages in games for Wii and the Nintendo DS system. One of my favorites is Peach Beach from the Mario Kart games. I like to dig in on Koopa Troopa Beach in the game Mario Sports Mix. Starshine Beach Galaxy in Super Mario Galaxy 2 is an entire beach world. There are a ton of beachy challenges to beat, including the Purple Coin Beach Dash. A lot of the levels in Donkey Kong Country Returns are beach-based, and Blowhole Bound is one that really stands out. In Mario & Luigi Bowser's Inside Story for the Nintendo DS system, you visit a very unique sort of beach. Black Beach's name is inspired by good old tooth decay, and it's surrounded by barriers that look kind of like big cavity-filled teeth. It's a little gross, but a lot of fun. If you like your beaches dark and mysterious, there is nothing better than the opening moment of the game, The Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening DX. This classic Game Boy Color title starts with Link lost at sea before he's washed ashore on the never-before-seen Koalint Island. The mood sets the stage for the adventure ahead. You can experience one of Link's most memorable adventures on your Nintendo 3DS today. Thanks to video games, the beach comes to you. Ah! Oh! Shark! Thanks, Allison! Ow! 
You want to know my new favorite thing to do on July 4th? Read some titles with the Nintendo eShop. If your Nintendo 3DS is connected to the internet, you can rate titles you've played and see how other users rate titles in the Nintendo eShop. To get started, click on the Nintendo eShop icon on the home screen. Then tap Rate Titles in the main menu. A list of the titles you've played will appear. Tap a title and you'll be asked to select the gender of the person who spent the most time playing it and their age. Then, give the title a rating of 1 to 5 stars. Next, choose whether you think the title appeals to everyone or gamers. And finally, decide what playstyle the title is more suited to, casual or intense. Review your rating on the top screen and then click Start Over or Submit. Your ratings are then compiled with those of thousands of other Nintendo 3DS users. To see what other users are saying, click the title you want to learn about and then click on Ratings. And there you go. So celebrate your freedom to rate titles today. Thanks for joining us today. Check back in with us next week when we check out the game Mega Man 5 and the game The Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening DX and more. Gary, look, the fireworks are starting. This is my favorite part of the 4th of July. Ah, mine too. Dark Gary would love this. Dark Gary. <laughs> Happy 4th, bros. <laughs>